know I ain't about the thousands of variety. You're chopping, swapping, rocking, mocking, stocking, lock it in my pocket. This full of my spit. I get him in a bitch, get him in a wrist. Hey, I'm really the son of a beast. I'm also trying to be not my son of a beast. Now the grandma's a son of a six. Yeah, man, I told you that I'm a monster. That's why I be Ooh. rapping nonsense. I do want your hands at the concert. What the fuck is that? Hands at the concert. Hit me. Oh. What's up, tribe? It's your boy Mo back at it again with another one for you today. And this one I'm really excited about because we're going to be talking about RM, specifically his track, Rap Monster. So if y'all been following me since my beginning of my journey and you checked out my first ever time listening to BTS, then you know that RM was one of the first people that stuck out to me because of his rapping in the song Butter. And the Hotter Remix video is the one that I watched first, so check that out. It's going to be linked in the description below. But basically, you know, ever since then, I've been going left and right in terms of my direction with BTS because they have such a big catalog. And I realized that I've never actually heard RM solo. And I figured what better place to start than the song Rap Monster, which is what his name stands for. So without further ado, we're going to jump right in because I know my boy got big plans for me. So let's check it out. Oh. oh, here we go. This beat is wild. Oh, he's insane. Alright, so first impressions, he's in an insane asylum, so obviously, you know, he's about to spit some hot fire and go crazy, uh, so I, I expect that it's going to pick up at some point because it's kind of been a little bit more low level in terms of the sound, so definitely looking forward to hearing that pick up if it does. Uh, but regardless, I think he's already displaying, you know, his arsenal of uh, ability with, with his lyrics, for sure. I realize also at this point that these subtitles are definitely not doing a good job. So don't worry, I'm not paying attention to those. I'm following along with the video. And yeah, let's see what else he's got for us. <laughs> Six names in my lawn. Huh. Six shots got me feeling two pocket eight. Gonna ace every guy's eye, yo. Huh. Cause you're going to pick up G. It says six shots got me feeling like Tupac, baby. What's up? Let's run that back. I just realized at this point as well, there's no chorus in this song. So he's just going straight bars, which always commendable in the rap community. Any song that doesn't have a chorus and you just spit in a whole verse basically on end is super respectable. And obviously, what better song for him to do that in than Rap Monster? He's displaying his abilities right now and he's killing it. 
Jada, Bibidi Babidi, Bubidi Babidi, Nimini Namini, Chigimi Chakami, Nikola Nagari, Chomoko Nogari, either the Nimini, Shari no Nagari. Now grab one of the don't rap, they rap and how many man I get, don't rap. Nako Jung Kumu, that's all Jung, don't rap, Nikola, Rebbe and Nidan, I know rap. Good enough, Trek, where you're the gap till, so Chon, I get Jada got till. I can just hang a cable, they got beer, don't they got the go in me that put it get injured. I pop it, rock it, knock it, never stop attacking some trashes, then pixel dies all up, so Chabi, no real back, so up, so Chabi. You know I ain't about the thousands, I'm erotic, you're dropping, swap it, rock it, mock it, stop it. Oh, I knew he was going to come with it, man. I told you all, I felt like it was a little bit kind of like lower energy in terms of the sound. Not to say that he wasn't coming with it because it was still fire for sure. But I knew, I had a feeling that he was just going to like level up with the intensity. And then that beat switch came in and it was automatic. So I uh, don't know all of the words, obviously, because he's speaking Korean. But I heard him talk about like don't rap a few times. He mentioned that and he repeated it. And I think this is supposed to be a song where he's basically showcasing his skills. He dropped it in 2015. So I imagine this was around the time or shortly after the time where he got a lot of uh, hate from, you know, idol group fan group and also the rap fan community where they were telling him basically like he sold out and so he's probably just saying like screw you guys like i got bars and i'm about to whip them out and show you so uh let me know if i'm wrong but that's my takeaway from this song and he's also talking about how he can rap non-stop right he said that in the song and i acknowledged that earlier no chorus it's just verse it's just bars respect i'm gonna rewind it so we can get that beast drop again you know why I ain't about the thousands, I'm riding your top and slap it, rock it, mock it, stock it, lock it in my pocket, just full of masses. Yeah, I get him in a bitch, get him in a wrist, have any added on the son of a beach. Now I'm also trying to be not my chase on of a beat. Now the grammar's a son of a six. Yeah, man, I told you that I'm a monster. That's why I be rapping nonsense. I do want your hands at the concert. What the fuck is that? Hands at the concert. Hit me. Ah. Hey. The joke ting, man. Get out of here with all that hate. Yo, I don't know who made that beat, but shout out to them for sure. I'm I'm gonna look that up after this because I'm really curious. That beat was super hard and it switched a few times. It kinda had like a classical rock type of vibe towards the end, which is kind of like similar to hip hop in the sense that it's like going against the grain and like basically just saying, F you, we're gonna do what we want, right? So I like that they whenever they blend hip hop and uh rock together it's always a good sound for sure uh he killed that man not much else to say i, I already gave you all my thoughts i love everything about the song the video itself as well he's just going insane right like that's all there is to it so i hope you guys enjoyed this video this definitely met my expectations if not exceeded them and i'm looking forward to diving into more of rm solo work as well so would appreciate if y'all could leave me some notes in the comments around what other solo RM songs I should check out next, because I know you guys know the best when it comes to BTS. So if you watch the video this far, I'll know, because you'll be giving me those recommendations. And I'm looking forward to seeing y'all soon in the next video. So make sure you subscribe and you turn the notifications on so you can get alerted and be one of the first ones in there. All right, well, until next time, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Stay safe, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you soon. Peace.